Welcome to ClearTex eWay Build Software. ClearTex eWay Build Software provides you a platform to generate the eWay Build faster and accurately. Let me walk you through the software and explain you how to use the software. First, we will log in using the ClearTex login ID and the password. As soon as you log in, you can view the all GSTN dashboard. Here, you will find all the GSTN of your business and their respective branches. In order to add new GSTN, go to Settings and click on Add New GSTN button. Provide your GSTN number, display name, and the name of all the branches under this GSTN. You can either enter comma or press enter or even click on create option after entering each branches to provide multiple branch names. After filling all the necessary details, click on save to proceed. On clicking save, you can see the GSTN added by you under the list of GSTN. You can edit any details or add more branches under your GSTN anytime by coming to the settings page. To add it, click on edit button against the respective GSTN and make your relevant changes and save it. After this, you are all set to create the data for the generation of eWay bill. Now proceed towards all GSTN dashboard and Click on import button to import your transactions into clear text. You may import your data either by using the clear text standard template or you may use your own Excel template by using the custom mapper. In order to use the clear text template, download the template provided under the new import page. Then fill all the necessary fields in the clear text template and import the same into the clear text eWay Build software. In order to upload the data in our clear text software, click on select file from the computer. Now browse for the file that you want to upload and click on open. Your file will be successfully imported and you can see the list of the documents under the document pass tab if there is no validation error in your document and under the fail tab if there is any validation error. Along with this you can also view the total number of rows processed, total number of document passed and total number of the document failed. In respect of the failed transaction, you can download the error report Excel where you can view the validation error in the document uploaded by you with the error message. In order to rectify the mistake, you can correct the data in the downloaded Excel and then re-import the downloaded Excel again. If you want to import another file, then click on import again and follow the same procedure. If at any time you want to view the branch wise import history under your GSTN, then you may click on import history under the import tab. Here you will find detail of the Excel imported by you along with the uploaded date and its status and other details like branch name, file name, file format, the past transaction, the total row processed and the status of the file. You can see more information about the Excel by clicking on view. It will take you to the more detailed view of your import. If you want to proceed towards the generation of the eWay bill, then click on continue to all eWay bills. 
all e bill dashboards price provides you with the branch wise viewing of e bills in general the transporter detail is not present at the time of creation of invoice therefore we have the feature where you can bulk update the transporter detail after importing the data in order to make the user experience simple and easy we have provided various filters like supply type sub supply document type vehicle number ewe bill status seller pin code document number and etc by using this feature you may filter the invoice for which you want to bulk update the transporter detail or generate the ewe bill under all ewe bill you may update the transporter detail in bulk by selecting the invoice that have the common transporter mode vehicle number or maybe the distance or maybe the vehicle number under all ewe bill you may update the transporter detail in bulk by selecting the invoice after filling the transporter detail save it and the transporter detail would have been updated in all your selected transactions After updating the transporter detail, you may use the filter features to filter the invoices for which you need to generate the EV bill. After making the selection, click on Generate EV bill. Enter your EV bill login ID and the password, and proceed to login. Enter the captcha displayed on the screen. and click the submit button on clicking the submit button your eway bill will be successfully generated and all the eway bill detail like eway bill status eway bill number generation date expiry date will appear on your all eway bill dashboard on successful generation the eway bill status will become the generated an eway bill number will be shown under the eway bill detail column if only part a is generated which means where the vehicle number was not there then the eway bill status will show as part a and the unique id will be visible under the eway bill detail column if the generation has failed then the status will be shown as failed and the reason for failure will be shown under the errors If you want to view the EV bill of all the branches under the particular GSTN then you may view the same by clicking on view all EV bill under the all GSTN dashboard here you will be able to view all the transactions of your GSTN you may generate the EV bill bulk up the transporter detail even through all the branches EV bill dashboard through the same procedure discussed earlier thank you thank you for watching video